Well, I'm back down in Savannah, Georgia. I absolutely love this place. We're going to go out exploring, get some nice restaurants, get some culture, maybe even go down to the beach. Really looking forward to this. But you know who's not having a good time, who's not feeling the best right now? Dirty diaper Donnie Trump, because he's getting nervous about this upcoming debate on June 27th in Atlanta. Now, he was all in at first. He thought this will be great. I'll kick Joe Biden's ass. But as he gets closer, he gets nervous. First, he goes to Joe Biden and says, let's take a drug test. Joe doesn't give a fuck about that. And he was all in about the drug test, too. Up until the time he met the probationary officer that he has to report to, they asked him to take a drug test. And he said, yeah, no, nah, I'm not going to do that. So apparently the drug testing's off the table. <laughs> But he's got another thing. He's challenging Joe Biden to take a cognitive test. You know, see if your mind's intact, Alzheimer's, dementia, all that shit. I'm sure Joe could take it, and he might have some slow parts, but he would pass it. Donald Trump is thinking, well, I've already done that, so I don't have to do that. He did that with his uh, former uh, presidential doctor. You know that goofy fucker. In fact, Donald Trump said that. I've already taken my cognitive test with my good friend and former doctor, Ronnie Johnson. <laughs> Only problem is, is his name is Ronnie Jackson. Donald Trump asking Joe Biden to take a uh, cognitive test. Can't even remember the fucking name of his own doctor. This is going south for Donnie. It's not getting better. <laughs> this is going to be fun if he shows up.